This is an update on the Automagic Tangents plugin. It's very easy to use. You need to have two circles or an arc and a circle to do the ta uh, to make a tangent between. And you've got a number of options when you run the tool. So for when you install it, you get this little icon, uh, which you can put onto the toolbar. And all you have to do is run it. So what I'm going to do is uh, just point out that if you try to make a tangent on a circle that's got full of flat lines made up of segments, you'll find you don't know where to connect to. So first thing you need to do is have, have more um, line segments in your circles. So here I'm going to type in say 400. And this one here I'll just put 300. And now when I run the tool, I'll select these two here, just select these two and run the tool. I get these options here. So you can have internal or external tangents. Um, what this will do is it'll, it'll connect all tangents that are available. Uh, then you've got extend the tangents uh, 10 millimeter. So basically wherever the tangents touch on the circle, it'll extend past 10 mil. And that can be handy if you want to do 100 mil. It depends what you're drawing. That could be handy uh, for connecting to other geometry. And then the last option is you have a choice of lines or guides. So let's run it on just as it is default. And there we have it. So we've got that. Now let's see if that is actually the correct tangent. So there you go. It is exactly correct. So I'm going to do on do and select it again and run the tool again. And this time I'm going to make that zero and click run. And just to see if it is correct, I'm going to erase all this here internally. That and that. And then just draw a little line to heal the surface and see. Yes, so it, it works perfect. So there's your tangent and that. So I'm going to do undo and just point out a few things. You can use the tool, as I say, with uh, segments, like uh, just arcs, like that. And say, uh, do an internal tangent this time. So I'm going to select that and that. Click Run. This time I'll select Internal. And We'll extend it past 100 mil just to see and then run the tool. And you see now there we've got 100 mil past extension, uh, which can be handy to enter whatever you're doing drawing wise. Uh, and there's our tangent from here to here. And then it picks up another one here and here and you see it's spot on. So we'll do undo and we'll do one more just with uh, guides. We'll go back to this full circle so you can see it a bit better, right? So zoom in, select these, click, go to guides, and we'll do externals, and we'll just put a hundred to show you that the guides are not extending beyond. So there you go. You can use that as a a tool, and then you can do parallels off these. Uh, these guidelines if you need them as well. So that's basically the new update to the plugin. Uh, if you just look down below, there's an email there, and you can send an email to the to to get this plugin sent to you, uh, and then you'll get sent it to you in an email. Thanks for watching.